it increases blood pressure, causes increased risk of heart attack, it affects your brain functioning. So vaping is very popular nowadays as a safe alternative to smoking and it is even marketed as a safe method to quit smoking because it contains only nicotine, not the tobacco or smoke. It is a misconception that vaping is safe. It comes with its own various potential health risks. Nicotine, which is a major component in vaping, is highly addictive. It increases your heart rate, it increases blood pressure, it causes increased risk of heart attack, various lung conditions like chronic bronchitis, coughing, wheezing, throat irritation. It affects your brain functioning. So people who want to quit smoking, who go for vaping, they take up more nicotine into their body per day than when they vape. So eventually they became addicts of vaping and then become smoker again. Many high school students and teenagers end up vaping because they are not aware how harmful vaping is. So if you are already a vapor and you want to quit, it is possible. You have to have a strong willpower and determination to quit vaping. You should communicate with your family, friends, your doctors to take guidance and help from them. So say no to vaping, no to smoking. The sooner you quit, the quicker your body can rebound and repair itself.